So this question is a diagram question. Really any question that provides some visual input, I'm gonna call a diagram question. More specifically, this question is a graph question. So whenever I see a graph, I look at the heading here, which we have in this case, temperature of a cup of coffee during an experiment, where the x-axis is the time since cup was removed from heat source, and the y-axis is the actual temperature. So we can see with the trend of the data points here that the longer, you know, the, the longer the time frame since the cup was removed from the heat source, the lower the temperature, which is exactly what we would expect to happen. So we have in the information provided up here, in an experiment, a heated cup of coffee is removed from a heat source and the cup of coffee is then left in a room that is kept at a constant temperature. The graph above shows the temperature in degrees Fahrenheit of the coffee immediately after being removed from the heat source and at 10 minute intervals thereafter. Okay, so again, we see that from the graph. So question number five says, of the following, which best approximates the temperature in degrees Fahrenheit of the coffee when it is first removed from the heat source? So first removed from the heat source is here, right? Zero minutes of time since the cup was removed from heat source. That's when it's first removed, right? So we're up here. This point that we have here is right below 200 degrees Fahrenheit. So the only answer that makes any sense here would be choice D, the 195 degrees Fahrenheit.